The average right now statewide is 386 a gallon. That's 75 cents higher than it was just one month ago. And the fear tonight, that Russian oil ban will cause prices here to go up to $5 a gallon. Oh my God, I just spent $6 in my gas tank and gas is like, what, $4 a gallon almost? Beverly Chambers putting a few bucks of gas in her car, and it's but one way she is now cutting back because of rising gas prices. Hey, we're carpooling now, and um, it's every aspect of my life I had to cut back on everything. You got to cut back. You got to go back. We got to go down to one vehicle. My wife had to see what time she get off of work. I drive her vehicle. The president banning Russian oil imports is expected to increase the prices even more. Mississippi energy producers are hoping that will prompt the president to open up more offshore drilling in the Gulf of Mexico. And you know, the best policy for, for Mississippi and for the United States is uh, to produce our energy here. But Patrick Sullivan with the Mississippi Energy Institute says even if more offshore production is approved, that won't suddenly change gas prices. There's not a button to push today to turn production on tomorrow. Consumers are dealing with dramatically rising gas prices, and the Attorney General's office says it is on the lookout for reports of price gouging. The most important place that we get our information is from consumers. So if you, again, think that you are being price gouged or you're concerned, the best thing you can do is contact us and take a price, uh, a time-stamped picture. Local consumers you can't let it get past that. are watching the pop prices. Today's the first day I've really thought we might need to start taking a look. In most cases, drivers are also having to cut back in other areas because of it. Going out to eat, just getting fast food and just spending money on stuff that I would usually, yeah, I had to stop that because of that right there. The Attorney General's office says just because one gas station may be charging a little bit more than another does not necessarily constitute price gouging, but they do want to hear from you if you do think you might be coming across one of those cases. The phone number to call 601-359-3680. Live in Jackson, Scott Simmons, 16 WAPT News.